Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Portal 2 Blind. Last time we completed Chapter 1 and found out that GLaDOS isn't dead because we rebooted her on accident. This time we continue our testing. Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By Honestly, way, yeah. Thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Ugh. Good. That's back online. I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test. Which involves deadly lasers, and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Sounds like a pretty sound test. So, from this point on, everything is completely blind because I did play up to this chapter uh, when I was testing out the game earlier on. Uh, that looks like that's going to activate this. So we'll go ahead and hop on it. Boom! Not Easy. Bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests to do. What if I finish them all? What then? Thermal what now? Uh, I guess it's not important. Let's move on! Uh, you shouldn't peer into that laser like that. Oh! Oh, they just duck under it. This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. So I believe these old panels here actually tell you what you'll be encountering in the stage, I suppose. The test. Uh, she said there'd be one in the corner. Hey, sure enough. Oh, hi there, you're not dead. That's nice to know. Did that move it? Can I... There we go. So this is a laser redirection cube. Basically, you point it where you want the laser to go. And we want it to go right there. It looks like that worked just fine. There is a thing. Okay. You can do that. I'll step up here before I do this. Hi there. Oh. Oh, that's okay, I can grab it. Wait, where does that, like, point it? Hey, you can see us moving it. That's cute. Alright. Well we done. must move on. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. Oh. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. Hmm. Well, you know... What can I say? We're just the best testers around, getting results we didn't expect didn't expect it. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. Oh, that's cute. Well, thanks. This will just fix itself right up. What do we have? Oh, we have that. There's a laser thing, there's a laser thing, and we have a cube. Let's deal with the cube first then. Can't do the cube with that. Perfect. That's not the right button. Um, can I? Congratulations, not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. Oh, okay. Well, that's nice. I'm going to not say anything about that. Oh, hey. Change of scenery. Oh, we're going to see the... The... One moment. The plasma things, whatever. You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. Uh, that's my sole purpose in life. I don't do anything other than that, ma'am. I just write down here. Anything special in these papers? No. Because I know there's some papers, at least uh, as I've seen, um, that actually have information about the story of the game. No, oh, sure enough, the cameras are following us again. That's nice. Where does that want to go? There's a cube over there. I'll go ahead and grab that, I suppose. Let's not die. Thank you. Now what? 
That is not a laser redirection cube. Here, let's uh give it some room. And that moves that platform back and forth. So we need to be over there. Here. I'll do this. Hey, we can hop on it though. That works. Um Boop. Perf oh. Here we'll just Boom. I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. Wow. Just burning me on every chance you get. That doesn't look safe. We must move on. For science. The party has arrived. What's that? Oh, we're gonna get some. Oh, that's showing off the slingy thing. We didn't actually get the plasma bridges or whatever they're called in the last mission, so I guess it's just random. Somewhat. Farewell cubes. We didn't this need all those. This involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faceplate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were highly informative. They could not. Good luck. Oh. <laughs> Results were highly informative. They could not. Okay, we need to get the cube over here. It drops down right there. Oh, we need to uh, catch it in midair, don't we? I got you, buddy. I am a liar. Oh, it keeps bouncing. That works. Just, uh... Huh. Gotcha. Easy. Boop. Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too extensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. <laughs> I thought that was interesting, didn't you? Let's see what the next test is. Oh, advanced aerial face plates. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. You're welcome for that. You know, what What really makes this game, or this game series in general, um, it is really good, but just GLaDOS is just an amazing antagonist. Just the best in terms of, can I please? Thank you. In terms of uh, sassiness. I suppose. Where is this gonna sling me? Oh, that looks safe. Um, don't wanna go but there. Oh, this is the square. The square repult. Oh, hi there. Oh, look at that. Fast thinking. Hey, well, I'm at the end. Uh, where does this get dropped? In the middle of it? Oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes oh. there's still trash in them. Standing around, smelling, and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. Uh, what do I want? Do I want the spear? Because I will take it. You don't have to test with the garbage. It's garbage. Press the button again. What? It's a spear! Guess not cubes are not, uh, appreciated around here. Can I really not use it, though? Like, honestly? I want to test it, just to see if it'd work. Hey, don't you go anywhere. Probably, oh, it's probably gonna like roll out. Boop. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, I have to use the cube. Dang. To me. Oh. Just fix that real quick. Hey, this'll work. Won't it? Wait, no, it's gonna no, I thought it would go at an angle, but it didn't. Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. Which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. Oh, <laughs> that's why I had to call you garbage a second time. God, the quotes are good. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. 
Anyway, just an interesting science fact. Oh my god. Science fact. I love it. That's not a normal cube. Excitement. Oh, oh hey there. Did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. Oh. Oh, wow. That could have killed me. I think. Oh, I'll just... No. I fizzled that one, too. Oh, well. We have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely oh. worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. Oh. Hi there. You're not dead. That's good to know. Oh, can I... Okay. I get it. Farewell. I will see you in another life. Uh, what do we have going on here? I think I know what we have going on here. Uh, here. Let's, uh, grab our cube. Don't. Okay. Uh, what's over there? Human there. Oh, farewell. What am I standing on? All right. Um, that's fine. We can just get back, right back up there. Hi there. Um, I want to shoot the cube through this one. Boop. And... Oh, I guess I'm going to. Except I hit two spots on the way down. Here, we'll just, uh, have fun. Oh, I guess I should go. Hello. Just, uh, set you right there. Perfect. And now there. Oh! Saved that one. Alright, let's get going. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This, this one, one doesn't. Broken. Don't take anything with you. I, I don't think I can in that one, sadly. Oh well. Forward! What's this here? This oh. next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I see. I told you about them in the last test area that did you not did. have one. What do we have here? 8 out of 22. Rebuilding. Hey, another camera. How cute. So this is an emancipation grid. Uh, you can't shoot your portal gun through them either. The turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. There. If you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. Uh, I... Slightly tempted to really slow that down and see if it actually comes out to anything normal. In fact, I'm gonna do that. So, uh, I guess I'll show you that. Hey, there's a little shooty hole. And oh, there's a cube. Alright then. Let's grab it. Go ahead and make a portal that I can go through. Uh, where do we want this? Straight through there. Lasers can go through emancipation grids. Good thing. And does that open the door? It does! He do! And we're done. Nothing, nothing snarky to say this time? Fine. I'll just go on on my own. Oh, chapter three. Okay. Wow. Already. Uh, in that case, we are at a decent time here. I think I'll end it off before we go on through chapter three. So uh, join us when we do that, and goodbye.